Happy Sunday morning, gossip fans. Rise and shine, it's time to get up. So listen, as you may or may not know, the auction of the Murdoch family uh, furniture and everything from Moselle went on sale last week um, down there in Georgia. Well, the house, this is all the furniture from Moselle. It was auctioned off by an auction house in Georgia. And apparently tons of people flooded into the site and they snapped up all of everything. And a lot of the stuff went well above market value. That ugly brown leather sofa went for $30,000. I hope that was like the sofa and the chairs and the rug and all the bad juju because mm -mm, you would not find me sitting on that sofa. This is what I want to know, right? First of all, they didn't show all the stuff on TV. They didn't show all the stuff on the website. They were like, oh, you have to come in and take a look and see what's what. But of the people who were there, a lot of people put like little videos on social media or whatever. So I was looking it over. These people, the Murdochs, had terrible taste. Like, okay. So say you buy some murder dishes, right? Are you like, oh, look, would you like to have um, some cheese off this lovely turtle cheese plate that a dead lady used to own? No. Like, now listen, I will pinch a penny. I will pinch a penny with the best of them. I love me an estate sale. So if I could find like some good baking dishes, some hard to find Pyrex, why, yes, I will take your dead grandma's Pyrex. But like murder victim dishes? Hmm. No, thank you. Does the bad juju come with the sofa and rugs or do you have to pay extra for that? And what about the beds? Do you want the bed that Alex Murdoch has been sleeping in? Not me. Like, are there stains? Is it? Does it come with a mattress? Are the, oh, it's a baffling. You know what I would want though? The cars. Is it bad that I went with the cars? I might take a car. I might take a golf car, but only if I could get it, get it at a really, really good deal. This is what I want to know. Um, there was horns. There was flags. There was, it just was very hee-haw meets the Beverly Hillbillies. That's what I saw when I saw all of that stuff. And if you're into hee-haw or if you're into the Beverly Hillbillies, God bless. Enjoy your trashy Americana leather horned haunted furniture. But me... Not so much. I prefer cool tones, blues, grays, whatever, but nobody asked me and it's not like I was going anyway. But if you were going to an auction, what would you buy, right? Any kind of auction. Sometimes you get caught up, like I get on eBay and I'm like, oh, bid, 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 I wanna win. And the next thing you know, I've overpaid for a hammock for my backyard, but that happens. Also, the things that I buy on eBay, are most likely not haunted. I also don't buy the things of murder victims as far as I know, but who knows? Maybe those eBay sellers are lying to me, but if they do, I am giving them a very low rating. All of that to say, um, the Murdochs sold off all their stuff. They got like five, I think Buster's portion was like $600,000 um, of his mother's estate. Now listen, they were saying Maggie's estate was worth like $5 million. And now we're only talking about like $600,000. That's a big difference. Also, are the Murdochs rich? You know, everybody's like they're prominent, right? Like there's prominence and then there's cash. And of the two, I would rather have the cash, please. And thank you. But, um, I'm getting the feeling that the Murdochs are not that rich. Now, I think they're small town rich. Like, if you live in a small town, having more money than most of the people in your small town, well, that's not that hard. But like, big city rich? I think I've said this before. I don't think they're rich people rich. I think they're poor people rich. Like, they surround themselves with poor or, poorer people, people who have less income than them. So they feel very rich. Also, they were powerful. So that means something. But if they move to like Miami or... Pennsylvania, like they might not be that rich. And why is Alex like scrimping and saving for his appeal? Uh, isn't your rich brothers and sisters or whatever helping you out with that? Do they still think you are innocent? Okay. Um, the Murdochs have a lot of secrets. This we know. I think they have more secrets than we thought before. Um, I am just floating a theory that the Murdochs kind of broke. I think they're poor people rich, not rich people rich. I know rich people. These people, not them. All right. I have to go do some more research on the Rosebud murder case, Rose Petal murder case, that other crazy murder case down in South Carolina. So I'm going to do that and I will report back. You have a good Sunday. Bye.